give us a countdown anymore. It just starts. Hey everybody, I'm Sarah with athriftymom.com. I'm going to go ahead and post the link right here as you guys filter in. Um, then you will see what we're talking about. So today's video is called This is Weird and Brilliant All at the Same Time. Which means we're talking about myself, my children, my posterity. No, we are... <laughs> Uh, weird and brilliant is something that very much um, explains me or my this children. It looks very red on video. It does. Mm -hmm. We got a new lip sense color. Except for she didn't like it, so she would lay it in like color. Yeah. No, I did not like it. I was a little scared of the boldness of it. No, anyway, no. so we're going to wait for some of y'all to hop on. We're going to talk about my new thing. So my husband quite often orders things in the mail, and then they show up, and I have no idea he's ordered them. And, hi, Don. And, um... Quite often, I'm wondering what the heck he was thinking or why he... So, tomorrow, I think we're... Or maybe later tonight, I don't know. We are growing full-on shrooms in our bathroom. Like our mushrooms... Yeah, we're growing mushrooms in our bathroom. Looks like they're growing out of a toilet paper roll, but no, I guess it's like a shroom log. I don't know. My husband thought it'd be fun to grow mushrooms. He doesn't like mushrooms, but we're growing mushrooms. That's the kind of thing my husband buys. Yeah, my husband's right there in the background. So, this little thing came in the mail... And uh, I was like, what's this? So he's like, oh, it's for our trip. And I was like, all right. So, um, you know how you like look at like Jay Leno or, well, Jay Leno's not on anymore, but, you know, and they'd be like America's dumbest products. But let me tell you why it's brilliant and why you need one of these in your life. Um, hey, Sherilyn. All right. So this is what comes in the bag. Hi, Patricia. So, oh, and I should state... I don't have a discount code for this. We just, my husband just bought this off um, the internet. I do have a link to it though. Um, so if you want to get one, and it is, does happen to be 40% off right now. So I was like, oh, hey, well, it's 40% off. I should tell you all about it. So inside comes with your very own um, night mask. So, you know, there you go. I never, is this thing to cover your eyes or is it to cover your nose? Like, someone tell me that wears one of these. Is this thing to, like, cover your nostrils? Why would you cover your nose? I don't know. Like, maybe you're a heavy breather and, like, you need to... It's probably to sit on your nose. Mom, or maybe it goes Mom, up the top. so you can't see any light that goes through. Oh, you like, can't see any light down. that goes... Oh, but then that would, yeah, it covers your nose. Oh, I don't know. Maybe. Anyway, it comes with an awesome night-night mask. Um, it's to block the light. I know, but see? does it go on the bottom or the top? I'm a little confused. I, go around your nose I don't wear those. Because that's for like the little. Okay, and then it comes with your own pair of earplugs. So, um, those are amazing. Got one for a gag if sadly lost it while moving. <laughs> All right, so here are the earplugs, and then this is the um, awesome thing inside. It goes on the bottom. All right, well. Okay, <clears throat> so I will say we have taken this out, played with it, messed with it, because I definitely wasn't going to haul it along on our trip. If it wasn't useful, I do have to say, you know how like a lot of times like you get something and then you pull it out of the bag, you can never figure out how to get that back in the bag. This goes in and out really easy, which is really convenient and really nice. So this is an inflatable travel pillow, but it looks like something a very strange person would use, which I guess I'm a strange person because I plan to use it. And I'm really excited about it. Oh my gosh, I'm going to review that pillow. I told them that I want me to get laughed at. <laughs> All right. So, this is what it looks like. It has a nice fleecy cover on it. Like I said, guys, my husband just bought this. We weren't asked to review it or anything. We just bought it, and I thought he was a ding-dong, but I'm actually quite loving it. So, so there's a hole ostrich at the top, and there's holes on the side, okay? So, hole in the top, hole in the side, flat bottom. Okay, so it's supposed to take five breaths to, um, can your daughter stop growing? She's looking so grown up, right? <laughs> All right. Do I have to press this when I'm blowing it up? Okay. So it's supposed to take five breaths. So let's see. One. And it is nice because it has this little button. So like the air is not just blown right back out at me. So that's nice. Two. Three. I took five of my breaths. All right, well, maybe I don't have enough breaths. I'm only at three, hey? Okay. Are you doubting my next two breaths? I'm going to blow you away here. I'm going to be so impressed with my power, my lung powers. Okay, ready? <gasps> okay, maybe I really don't have enough air. Okay, one more breath. 
So the nice thing about it only taking a couple breaths, like five to ten, maybe five if you're a man, ten if you're a woman, I don't know, is you don't want to have to be something like, and someone sitting next to you that you've never met in your life, you're like next to him, you're like, are you there with your little pumper? Hello, how are you? I'm going to be next to you for the next five hours, and I'm pumping up my air pillow, and they're like, oh my gosh, stewardess, can I have another seat? Okay, so let's try one more breath. Seven. All right, so that was a good six, six and a half breaths. There we go. And, and then it comes with a plug. So this is what it looks like, people. And this is why I thought my husband was the weirdest dude ever for ordering this. I was like, I am not taking that on a plane, but let me tell you why it is all sorts of brilliant. What do you think of it, Keely? She hasn't seen it before. You've never been on a plane before. Okay. So let's pretend we're on a paint plane. That's why she's sitting right next to me because when you're on a plane, all of a sudden it's like Smallville. Y'all got like this much space, right? Okay, so there is a head hole right here. I am flying tomorrow morning. I leave my house for the airport. Awesome. Oh, at 4.15, that is not awesome. Okay, so here's the cool thing, guys. You can put this right here in your tummy. Let me get sideways here so you can see it. Okay, ready? So your hands can go in here so you can kind of hold it to you if you want. And then your head goes in the hole. Ready? I know that doesn't sound exciting. Okay, you've never traveled you've on an airplane traveled. before, so you don't understand the whole process of trying to like find a comfortable position and like the 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 tray rest things like right about here and you're like trying to like stack up your jackets to like lay on it. Okay, so this can go on your tray rest or your knees. And then you can pop your head in here and you can just let your head go, guys. It doesn't have to Okay, so I don't know if you can see me. Hello. So the thing is, is if you try to put your head on anything else, you would suffocate. So the air is an air hole, like, so you can breathe. But also how convenient is this? If you want, you can put your book inside of here. <laughs> and you can read your book. You can read your book in peace and quiet. Nobody else has to see what or, you are reading. Or your tablet. Your tablet. You can be playing your games in here. Oh, sorry. My, um, you couldn't see? Well, I'm glad that you just bonked the whole thing all over. Okay, so I don't read on a plane. I probably, I don't watch, but my husband, like, loves to watch videos. So he could totally put his little phone in here, pop his head in here, and then watch it, okay? So if you've never flown before... <laughs> Myself. If you've never flown before, you're still going to think, okay, that's the dumbest product ever. Hey. Like, no one's going to use this. But when we flew to France and there was no way to, like, comfortably position yourself, this would have been absolutely brilliant. Okay, so now let me show you, well, too. Well, and then the neck pillows, your head gets kinked. Yeah, the neck pillow, so your head you does up, get all you, kinked. On the trip to France, you tied your head to the seat. <laughs> I totally did, guys. Um... So when we went to France, I bought, I brought myself a big scarf and I literally, I tied my head to the seat, like to my own seat. And then that way I couldn't like flop around. And the guy next to me had taken like an Ambien. He was the writer of, what was that movie called? The Other Wife? The, the Other, other Girlfriend? The, the, other, the Other Woman? The, the other, other Woman, I think it was with... Um, Gwyneth Paltrow? Yeah, we couldn't, anyway. He was like the writer of that, and he was telling me all about it. And he was like, do you want free movie tickets and stuff? And anyway, um, so he's like, oh, by the way, I'm going to be taking an Ambien. So for like 12 hours, he was flipping and flopping in my lap all over me. So I just tied my head together so we didn't have like a mid-air collision as we were both trying to sleep. Brandon said that's such a good idea for a plane. Ha, ha, ha. Well, for, um, like for guys when you or tall people, when you lean forward and try and sleep on the tray... Your head's up against the seat in front of you because there's not enough depth. Yes, there's so not. So this way you're more vertical but leaning and sleeping and you're not like falling on your arms. So let me, so like I said, so you can just put it right here and then your head goes in here. So you can breathe. You don't suffocate yourself. But then, you know, you want to be able to use it, but you don't want it to be all huge and boxy. And then, like I said, you don't want to be the weird lady like pumping it up. <laughs> you know, so it took me six and a half breaths to get it full. But then let me show you how easy and fast it deflates. And they do come with a one-year 
warranty and you do not have to send the package the um, defective if it happens if it's defective you don't have to send it back so the fact that it comes with like a one-year warranty is pretty darn cool um, would have been awesome for my trip from the East Coast to Hawaii yes so they're like eleven dollars which if you're gonna be on any type of a very long trip this is gonna be like the best I mean you could totally use it in the car too but it really is made for airplanes and the fact that you have such small space and that little tray in front of you. So just like that, it totally deflated and then it quickly rolls up and then, like I said, it goes right back into okay. his little bag um, quite nicely. Um, here, yes, that's what my husband bought it for, Angela. And um, actually, I didn't get quite enough air out of it. Let me push just a little bit more air out of it. So, um, like I said, when Matt bought it, I was like, that's the dumbest thing I've ever seen in my life. Why do you buy such dumb things? And he proved me wrong. So here I am saying, yes, he was right, I was wrong, this is brilliant. I could use this in long car rides to four hours to the nearest temple. Hi. Yes, that would be awesome. Okay, so there we go, just as fast as that. It is now flat. Don't forget, it does come with earplugs and um, an iPad thing. Um, yeah, I can show you how it works again real fast. So you just pop this off, and then you need six to seven good breaths. I'm going to have to breathe in between so I don't pass out on y'all here. Ready? Okay, ready? One, two, three. Too. All right, so it's got the little plug there, and then so there it is. If you missed, it's got an open cavity right here, and this is what your hands are going to go into, or your hands don't have to go into this. But you can also, this is what you would put your book or your movie, like your tablet, down in here to watch. But then you just put your head in here and you go to sleep, which is absolutely brilliant. The sun, the neighbors like car light is shining on my face but um anyway I thought I would share my husband's awesome find with you all so like I said it does come with a um, 12 month money back gear, uh, warranty and this is really <laughs> weird <laughs> but you're not gonna suffocate right no, to sleep like this. and when the passenger next to you I thought it was a life vest <laughs> no it's not a life vest it is um it's a travel pillow but it's like the weirdest travel pillow pillow you've ever seen in your life. Have you seen the ostrich one where they literally stick their whole head in there? <laughs> yeah. And it's like huge. But it can't be any worse than me. Like I said, when I was in France, uh, on my way to France, I tied my head to the back of my pillow because I kept flip-flopping all over a place and there was no way to get myself comfortable. I was so miserable. It squishes your cheeks. It squishes. Here, let's give you an up-close view of... It squished. It was gorgeous. How do you feel in there? Do you feel like it's comfy? Mm. Do you feel like you can breathe adequately? Um, Cindy, you can click the video and it will take you there, or you can just go to athriftymom.com um, and it will it give you the like link. It does smell like new shoes. It smells very good. And so the, the outer coating is like fuzzy. Kind of like some air mattresses are. Um, it's vinyl, but then it has like a fleece coating on it, which is kind of nice. So it, you're not, it's not like your face is gonna get like stuck to the vinyl, and after your after your trip, you have to like like a weird little like makeup ring. You have to like pop your head off, and the person next to you is like, "What are you doing in there like for a weird, four like, hours?" Like makeup ring. You can even guys, you can even put your drink in there and just here. Actually, let's try that. Wait, I'll get it. Here, get it for mom, okay? No, right there. Oh. Are you ready? Oh, check this out. Don't even have to come out. 
How awesome is that? <laughs> All right, guys. Well, I hope you. What did you do? I don't Everybody's like just them. seen our um um watch the movie. Then after you're done, take a photo and you know that your face <laughs> a ring on your face, right? So anyway, there you go. Um, can you use them multiple ways or only leaning forward? Um, yeah. Let, let, let's. No, I mean you can lean it. You can. That also said that you could like prop it up like this, so then your head just kind of like floats. <laughs> but <laughs> hello, <What's> everyone. <laughs> <laughs> but honestly, if I'm going to be sleeping in midair, I'd prefer that my face be covered. So I kind of like the, you just get to hide for a while. Because honestly, this way, I'd be, um, next to people, I'd be like, double chin in it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't snore, but I think with the pressure on my neck, I think I'd be like, <sighs> um, but it's actually quite comfortable. Probably not gonna get you a date because <laughs> it makes you look a little, a little um, heavier than you would normally be. In case of drool for me, yes, yes, absolutely. Um, let's flip you over here real fast, actually, and we'll show you the different positions that it shows you um, mm -hmm. using it in. All right. Ooh. All right, let me see how to flip this around. You can use it for a drool bucket. Okay, so um, it just shows that you take it out, you blow it up, and then you can put your arms in it. You can put your head. Oh, yeah, so you can put your head in it, or you can just put your arms through it and put your head to the side. Like so, this. Um, it's actually really comfy. Okay, so, yeah, there you I go. Like that. Put it on the side. Although, it gives you, like, this really awesome look of the face. Yeah. Um, or you can do it the way I said, which would make me um, kind of... <sighs> so. All right, guys. Well, once again, thanks to my husband and his very strange purchases, we had another fun review. I hope you guys found this useful. Um, you can find this item via our site, athriftymom.com. And we have it uh, labeled Lightweight and Portable Travel Pillow. And we are giving this... A total thumbs up. Um, I think for eleven dollars, it's going to be great. I will go ahead and well, eleven eighty-eight, so twelve. Um, I'll go ahead and give you guys an update after we've actually used on an airplane. Maybe once I get into an airplane, it looks like I'm it not going to love it. Cat tool, like a, a cat, like a cat, like playhouse, like a cat playhouse. Well, I'm pretty sure a cat would probably pop it. Or like her. a cat punching. A cat punching like pillow. Bottom, like if you love your like furry critter and you want to buy it for them, then go for it. But I personally bought it for a very long airplane ride. Okay. All right, guys. Chat with you later. Bye.